Hello dear friends and welcome back to my channel. This is a very special video today because I was in Bologna on the 24th of April for the worldwide famous uh, watercolor conference Fabriano in Aquarello and uh, it was an incredible experience. I don't have many images, I was too busy trying new colors and meeting people so I don't have many images of my um, of my trip to Bologna. This is the program of the the program of the conference and I met a lot of people and I tried a lot of new products and I'm now unboxing all the goodies that I've brought home for you my friends. So this is the program. It was three days in Bologna here in Italy packed with the watercolor people, watercolor um, expositions, painters, uh, suppliers, it was really incredible. So this was the program. It's really worth the next year a trip to Italy because also Bologna is a very beautiful city. And let's start with uh, this red bag that they give you when you arrive and register. So, this is what they give you when you register at the reception. And uh, there is a pin, Fabriano in Aquarelli in watercolor. This bookmark of uh, um, Cultural Association. A leaflet uh, from uh, Momarte, the, which is the online store that I always recommend to you. They always have incredible offers and uh, very good prices. If you live in Europe, I suggest that you get, check out uh, their online store. It's only in Italian, but it's very easy to browse and navigate and it's very helpful if you contact them. Uh, they will uh, help you for sure. And they always have incredible sales. They have uh, Windsor and Neutral until the end of April with an incredible discount. Then this was great. This is a new product from Roma Schmal and that's very, very emotional. I met Mr. Roma Schmal that was there in person. He's an incredible person, very down to earth. We chatted a lot. I have a picture with him. Let's see if I can put it in this video. But I made a story on Instagram with me, myself, with Mr. Roman Schmal, and we chatted a lot about his uh, watercolors that I like so much, uh, Roman Schmal, his Aquarius uh, line. And he gave to everyone these five, these five new colors that are not yet on the market, and they are Aquarius Red, PR214. Of course, I will swatch them in a separate video. This yellow light, Isoin Dolinon Yellow Light PY109, Autumn Green, wonderful, PG26, PY150, and PR122, French Ultramarine PB29, new color. And this, this I tried, I swatched it with him. It's an incredible color, this Aquarius Violet. But I will swatch them for you in a separate video. Let me see. I don't want to ruin this beautiful palette. Wow, five full pans to everyone that came in. Such an investment. He's a great guy, Roman Schmal. Such a passion for his work. Okay, I put this away. Maybe I could have just, yes, I made a mistake here. Then, this is uh, a leaflet. From Roma Schmal, always with the color chart. Wow, ah, such a trove! Here we have um, Windsor and Newton, the new granulating colors. There was a guy that was uh, swatching them for everyone, and here are the 34. They're not 
new actually they're just naturally granulating colors in the indication of um, the code the code number and then daniel smith he has um, an old dot card but dot cards are always uh, very 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 welcome they are new colors of 2019 but who cares well this also was given to everyone who registered at the at the counter and these are this is a dot card with different colors i will swatch everything in a separate video Oh, a tube for free, and this is quinacridone pink. I think I have it, but who cares? Quinacridone colors are wonderful. PV42, wonderful. And uh, a leaflet with their range. All the, col the color chart with the pigment the descriptions and everything. So welcome this. Thank you, thank you. Okay. I put this away and I'm going to the next bag because I came back home. Something I was given for free and something I bought. Then I stopped at the I stopped at the talents uh, counter and they gave me this uh, Van Gogh color chart uh, and Rembrandt color chart with the pigments and everything, very handy. And I also got some goodies from them for free. I got lavender from Van Gogh. Wow, very useful color. Van Gogh is a very good student gray. Then I got this um, cobalt, uh, no, this phthalo green yellow from uh, Rembrandt. It's a color I don't have. Wow, and this is fantastic. Uh, the Pigma Micron, you know that they were bought talents from Sakura, so they are one company. Thank you, thank you, talents. Then I also bought two tubes uh, by Rembrandt. You know that uh, I like this brand very much. They're very, they keep a very low profile, but they're very good. They're not so into marketing, but the quality is extraordinary. And they also, when I bought the tubes, uh, gave me this micron pen and I got this um, permanent red medium PR255, Pearl Scarlet, color that I wanted for a long time. The price was very good there, very huge discount. And uh, Van Dyke Brown, as I only have one from uh, My Mary, and uh, I wanted to try a different brand of Van Dyke Brown. Then, oh, Daniel Smith, Smith put the goodies in this bag with a QR code, and it's nice because they're saying, uh, scan to learn more about quinacridone pink so you can scan this and you will know the story of quinacridone pink but what is nice is this phrase explore a dot card of colors introduced in fall 2019 you remember it was during just right before um coronavirus started and they say now that we are all back together again so there was um hiatus i think that's the correct word in english where nothing was allowed now i almost forgot about coronavirus and uh, that's actually they couldn't really meet people so it's the first time that they really have this huge crowd in bologna for fabriano and aquarello and that's why they're proposing again these new colors that uh, were launched uh, this time in smith uh, in um, 2019. So it's worth mentioning that they are Alvaro Caliente Grey, Red Jasper Genuine, Alvaro's Fresco Grey, this is a signature series by Alvaro Castagné, signature series from Joseph Chubik. They have two colors, neutral grey and cool grey. Then they launched this grey titanium and uh, James Grey by Jane Blundell and warm gray once again by Joseph Chubby Butchwich. I'm not sure. So this is 
very interesting very interesting colors i have none of them so i'm very interested in swatching them then i went to see the sennelier stand and they gave me these um, opera rose for free opera rose is a very interesting color let me open it it's a full size tube it's interesting because if you use it in a sketchbook or not for selling because the problem is the the it is fugitive it's a very lovely color both they use straight from the tube or mixed they use pr181 which is different other brands use pr122 so one day i will swatch them side by side and um, it's a color that actually i like very much also in um, for portraits it's an interesting color problem is fugitive but if you know it's fugitive and you use it uh, in a way that respect this quality and you know it's fugitive it's a very nice color then i also bought some sennelier let me open this for you then from the sky working for sennelier i bought this color which is um, phthalo chanin turquoise which is a phthalo turquoise basically turquoise de phthalo and this guy was very nice because he was the same age exactly the same age as my son three days difference so i was uh, it was irresistible for me i had to buy something and sennelier is always worth having in a palette i don't have this color and i know it's a nice color to have so i put this away and i also bought uh, they also sold core i had a long chat with the guy from core and I bought these two colors from Core, green gold and ultramarine pink. This is because I want to swatch, I want to make a video about these colors so soon. Um, comparison of green gold and ultramarine pink, including the Core version. So this was the Sennelier gift. Then I went to see this guy that um, I was following following on internet and uh, these uh, watercolors are handmade and apparently very, very nice. They are extra fine watercolors handmade in Italy. It's two and a half hours by train, so five hours back and forth, but it was absolutely worth it. So I was traveling with Laura Raduazzo is a very good uh, artist from Italy and um, we would like to make a swatching uh, a streaming swatching on Instagram uh, together with Laura and he gave me all these colors to try can you believe this these are very expensive watercolors and I will soon swatch them on YouTube for you this is French um, ultramarine Oh, okay. French ultramarine, Bellatrix. They are, his mix is Alnitec. Saif, incredible colors. They look so interesting. Ultramarine pink once again. Betelgeuse. Betelgeuse manganese violet and uh, natural red iron oxide regel caput mortum very interesting this one and a uh, helon i think it's worth um, having a look at his uh, site i'll leave the link in the info box but uh, if you wait i will for sure make a video about his colors and these are we're all for free the guy's name is Carlo and he makes his own watercolor on uh, near Como, near the Lake of Como. They make in Lecco, which is on the Lake of Como, one of the beautiful Italian lakes. A place that I know very well. And this is the color chart that he gave me with all the information. And I think these are very high quality, can't wait. And this is a leaflet, Nila Colori. There are many handmade um, artisans, you know. I, I also 
am um, trying these new colors from another Italian artisan called Taliotis, Tatiana Taliotis. Those are very, very good. Then I saw Mr. Romashmal and he gave me this uh, new palette. It's identical to the one that I received at the counter. So I got two of those, uh, incredible. And also bought two colors. I was here with Mr. Schmal and I bought these two colors and I bought Caput Mortum PR102 Natural Red Iron Oxide. I'm very curious about this pigment. Let me see Caput Mortum. He makes it with PR101 Nila Colori, Carlo from Nila Colori. I'm very interested in Caput Mortum because uh, I think it's a good color for shadows in portrait. And I also bought uh, um, PY129, green gold. Another color that I'm very interested in. Great for mixes. Then there was uh, this uh, Korean um, counter of uh, brushes made in Korea. And it's hair and brush. You can buy them online at this website. They, I tried them, they really looked like very high quality. You can also buy them on Amazon. I will put on the links in the info box. And I bought, quite expensive, 18 euros, but I wanted a calligraphy, uh, a calligraphy brush for a long time. And I bought this one, it's a medium size. I never paint too large. And I think it's very interesting for for watercolor as well. I don't do calligraphy. I have a very sloppy hand uh, writing, but uh, this looks very interesting. These two kids from South Korea were adorable. So this is something that I bought as well. It was a unique opportunity. Then I have one more bag full of goodies. And this is um, Rembrandt. A Rembrandt that a bag that was given to me by a Rembrandt and it says what is done in love is done well it's a quote uh, it's a quote by um, Vincent van Gogh oh yes then I went to see Renaissance people and it was very interesting they were really adorable they're Polish just like Roman Schmal and they gave me two products for free I will for sure contact them, they're very high quality. I own some of them. And uh, they gave me Helio Turquoise and this uh, Geranium Lake, PR 63.1. You know that tubes and um, pans for Renaissance are slightly different. They're not exactly the same product. So it's great to try them both. And this was a gift. Let me see what else I have here. Oh, I think I skipped something. Um, I have one more phthalo green yellow by Rembrandt. I didn't realize that. Oh, okay. Then Core. You know that I bought these two course products, but the guy from Core was a Belgian guy. Very chatty, very interested in his work. Uh, very interested, very passionate about watercolor. So we chatted a lot and he gave me some uh, watercolor ground to try for free. I don't know, paint and chair. I'm not sure what this is. Let's see. Let's open it. He gave me plenty of goodies. So these, oh, these are dot cards. Uh, these are dot cards. Always welcome. Benzimi Dazzolong Yellow, Industrial Blue, Permanent Green Light, Manganese Blue, Quinacridone Red, Mars Orange Deep. Mars Orange Deep, very interesting. And Artist Trading Cards inside. Oh, this is Post Online Core Watercolors. I'm going to do this. How nice. So, this is Artist Trading Cards. Here they have. Uh, let me see. I didn't realize I had all these goodies from Core. These are other dot cards with different colors. Cobalt teal, green gold, quinacridone gold, 
transparent pearl and quinacno magenta and dioxazine purple. And here again, a different one. So, so many colors to try. I love dot cards. Um, and these are different colors, transparent red oxide, chromium oxide green, ultramarine blue, quinacridone violet, pyrrole red medium. Quinacridone violet, very interesting color. Pyrrole red medium, PR 254, interesting for portraits as well. Then they gave me this box. And I think there are tubes inside. These were for free. This guy was great. I'm going to swatch all these online because they deserve it. Mm. Don't find my cutter. So this is a core, three tubes. Uh, this is ultramarine blue. Always a very good color to have. Quinacridone magenta. Great colors, three primaries. And nickel azo yellow, great primary set. Thank you, thank you so much, Core, for all this. Then, here I have, uh, oh, Rosa Gallery. This is uh, Rosa Gallery, they gave me this, um, Wow, they gave me the new colors to try, the dot cards, and, uh, and also they gave me this uh, dot card also, Brave and Creative. They also gave me this uh, bracelet that I wore all day, you know, that I support Ukraine very much. So, the Paints of Freedom, this is their color chart. Colors to try. Carbon black, cobalt gray, azure green, jade green, golden brown, all the new colors. And they're all the granulating, the new granulating colors. So carbon black, violet black, cobalt gray, azure green, jade green, and golden brown. They are the new super granulating colors. Oh, this is so great. Can't wait to swatch them for you. Stickers, stickers, how pretty they are. Thank you, Rosa, thank you. These girls are from Ukraine with adorable, so these are the bracelet. I will cherish them. Now I don't know what I'm doing, just opening. It's, they're not in order. Once again, I go back, this is a Rembrandt color chart complete color chart. Thank you, Rembrandt. Thank you, Talents. What is this? Uh, Schminke. Yes, the complete uh, color chart from Schminke. This is great to have. Can you see this? Wait, it's a mess. Okay, here I have the Complete color chart of Schminke with the whole range of granulating colors. Can you believe that? I was so exciting to be there. Rembrandt, Van Gogh again with the color chart. I have two of them. This is, uh, this is a shop, a shop uh, in Italy. Belle Arti, Corbara Marino. Then I have um, samples from Fabriano. How great. Fabriano Artistico, so cotton paper, fantastic. I have different types, vegan friendly. I know this is a new quality, just released, improved. And I have a traditional white uh, hot dress. Uh, cold press uh, and rough and this is uh, then we have the same three varieties in extra wide these are very handful thank you oh then core once again he gave me for free this uh, very nice uh, tool 
and they gave me some grounds this is light dimensional ground these are watercolor grounds and those were gifts for free watercolor ground then what else i have here i have an extra lavender from van gogh and i have from daniel smith's uh, stick i don't know what color is it but it's a watercolor stick i think so thank you and also now one more ground cold press ground fantastic so you can basically paint uh, on any surface with these grounds made in us and here i have the samples of the grounds with the explanations i'll make a video about this these are the samples and um it was a great experience. Now I'll put away all these incredible goodies and I will swatch for them little by little. And I also got plenty of uh, bags to put things away. Now it's a big mess on my desk, but um, I will tidy up and I'll meet you soon with new videos for swatching these um, incredible, um, incredible supplies. Some I bought, some I got for free, more for free than paid. It was incredible. I hope to meet you next year in Bologna for uh, Fabriano in Acquarello. Incredible experience, beautiful city, incredible people I met. Such an intense day. It was awesome. It was amazing. I hope I can meet you there one day. And before I forget, Maybe some of my followers, were you in Bologna? Maybe we just crossed each other, we didn't recognize. So next year, if you go to Bologna, we should get in touch and maybe meet and, uh, I don't know, have a chat together or drink a cup of coffee or have lunch. It would be awesome to meet you there. If you were in Bologna, do let me know and tell me what you got in Bologna, what is your experience? Uh, I bet that some of you were in Bologna. Ciao, ciao. That was great. Ciao.